talented people are here in Melbourne, man. Like, this is just random. Just walk past here and, and look at the artwork, bro. So it's down here. Looks eerie as hell, man, down here. What the hell? Fucking get murdered down here. It's literally in an alleyway. How random is that barbershop? What up, what up everyone? We're down here in Collins Street to take some shots today. It's, it's Easter weekend here. Um, so Friday was, everything was shut, being the public holiday, being Good Friday. So hopefully everyone's out and about, the hustle and bustle. And uh, yeah, we can get some good shots and take you along, see a different part of Melbourne. Hope you enjoy. We're in this little uh, laneway here called Little Collins Street. Um, it's got some really cool little offshoots here where we can get some, I reckon, some great urban shots. And I've never actually uh, been around this area uh, to take shots. It was just something that I you know, thought about yesterday that I could um, have a sus at doing and have a look at it. It looks pretty cool. I mean, it's only 9.30 in the morning here, so it's, it's early. This part of Conlon Street as well is, has a lot of high-end shops around here. A lot of high-end shops. All the, you know, big-time watch brands are here. Um, fashion from, you know, Versace to, to uh, Gucci to Louis Vuitton. And then you've obviously got the big watch brands here as well. Um, at their own standalone stores, plus also stores that sell other brands. You know, we've got Monards. Um, we'll, I'll sh we'll show you around there as well. This looks like a really cool coffee shop. Maybe we'll, have a, we'll get a coffee, what do you think? Just gonna have a bit of a, <laughs> a quick chat here. Um, obviously got a coffee as you can see uh, here at that shop that you would have saw it was a tough shop I'm there and I was I was chatting with um, a lady in there who is staying in Melbourne at a hotel nearby and she was saying that there was a, a naked guy running down the street here like I was telling you before where all the expensive shops are full naked guy running down the street pretending that he was Jesus yesterday and she was just saying that, yeah, you know, he was either on drugs or something um, crazy because, yeah, he was just running amok. Anyway, I'm going to finish this coffee and then we're going to take some more photos and, and see how we go. Smash that coffee, by the way. That coffee was mad. Probably the best coffee I've had here in Melbourne, man. That, work, that coffee was tough. Really good coffee. I still can't get out of that story. I wish I had my camera turned on, but obviously I turned it off when I went to the cafe because I didn't want them to, um, you know, feel like, you know, I had recording, but man, nice lady, but fuck. <laughs> she actually showed me that photo too. I can't believe the guy, and some people, man, no shame, huh? But further down here, you'll see that this, this is where all the high-end shops are, where I was telling you about before. Um, you, all the high-end brands are around this area here.
hopefully I can get around here. Quick check, you know, check out some of these shops while we're here. Cartier. That shot there looks pretty cool. I don't know how it's going to turn out, but it's come my eye. Now, these watches are insane. They're this next level. But as I was saying, you can see over there, you got like Monards, Harold, Sell, Tom Ford, and other big brands, Monards with Omega, and other high end boutique watchmaking brands as well. Very cool. I wonder what's happening down there. Look at the line. Look at the line. Where it's starting from. There must be some sort of sale or shop or something open. Wow, let's have a we'll have a sauce, see what they're lining up for. And then we'll walk back because I don't think there's anything good to take photos down there of, but we just see what they're they're lining up for. Well that's mad. Look at the line. What the hell are they lining up for? Stuff that. <laughs> Bro, how insane is that? Bro, sauce out how talented people are here in Melbourne, man. Like, this is just random. Just walk past here and, and look at the artwork, bro. Look at that. This type of artwork too, you know, like the tags and everything like that. Not a super fan. I, mean, I know these are tags, don't get me wrong, but I mean like the actual artwork itself, not these dodgy ones that you see just with black spray paint. Like this is full talented. Like this is proper artwork. The detailing in, in it is mad. So I'm more past. Come on. We'll have, a, we'll have a play later. Well, I think they're lining enough for this shop over here, Loon or something. Is it a concert? Like, what am I missing, bro? I don't get it.
Where am I, bro? Where am I? So it's down here. Looks eerie as hell, man, down here. What the hell? Gonna get murdered down here. A barber, barber shop. How random. How random, bro. It's literally in an alleyway. How random is that barber shop? But bro, that's so random, that barber shop in there. I don't know if you saw it. And there was also a guy raging, rummaging through the bin. I don't know if he was collecting cans or what. But bro, what, what's that barber shop in the middle of the look, look where we are. Look. Look where the barber shop is. How are you even supposed to know where that is? And it looked dingy AF. Find some random stuff here. Seeing that guy sitting on the chair seemed like a cool shot. I'll cough it out later. This is what I was telling you about all these high end, all the high end watches and stores are around here. Obviously, watches are fixing on Rolex and whatnot. I tried to be as discreet as possible with that photo. Have a look at it. Um, yeah, she was giving me grease. She was greasing me off, probably thinking what I was doing, taking photos. Let's walk through here. We need to find somewhere to eat. I'm hungry, guys. Let's cut through here, go back towards the other end. Let's go. Good, how are you? 
Check out the restaurant's bar. I don't know if you saw some of those shots, but they looked like they turned out pretty cool with the lighting. The shots were insane. That lighting coming through there, sort of wet work. Wow, just wow. Guys, I took some mad photos before. I don't know if you can suss that little hat. I couldn't have the camera on because I was in the cafe. I'm out now, waiting for the food to come. But bro, the lighting. I don't know if you saw that, but she looked really cool. Still waiting for the food. I got free range eggs poached on toast with bacon. Surely it's gonna to be tough. Thank thank you, appreciate it, thank you very much. Would you like crushed pepper? Yes please. Can you grab me some salt as well? Yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> Sauce that. Smash it and then I'll, get, I'll uh, come back. Yeah. What a feed. Let's full smash that. Coffee was on point. The eggs, everything. That place was tough. And the lighting right now. There's a place here too where I parked the car, believe it or not. Um, it's been popping up on my Instagram, my TikTok. 
It's a, a restaurant that's in the car park. Like it's so random. I mean, have a look. We're in a car park here. And there's a restaurant in the car park, but it's supposed to smash it. It's literally supposed to be off its head. And usually there's lines for days to get into this joint. Yeah, it's like Thai food in a car park, bro. Like, random ass. That's the thing that, you know, here in Melbourne, so many different things that you, you just discover randomly. Um, but like so this, this thing, this place here has popped up on my TikTok, Instagram. You guys have probably seen it already. What a day. Um, we're just finishing up now. I reckon I got some crazy shots, especially towards the end of the day before, while I was walking towards the cafe to have a feed. Um, the lighting that was just protruding through the trees and whatnot just gave me, I reckon, hectic shots. I look forward to, to putting them up and seeing how they look on my computer. I'm glad that you stuck around. Hopefully you've been watching the full video. And uh, yeah, continue to support me, support the show. Don't forget to hit a thumbs up, subscribe, and there'll be more content coming. And uh, yeah, to the next episode.